Hey guys, Erwin Tech here, back with another video. Today we're going to be showing you how to install Linux mode on your Chromebook. So make sure to watch the entire video to know, find out all the cool things you can do. So let's get right into it. So first, in your settings, you want to go to your settings. Then you want to go to Linux Beta. Then you want to be a button. It says turn on. It will say a big setup right here. And then when it's done, you want to go down here, Linux Apps, Terminal. And then here you want to type in sudo apt update. Then it will just find all your updates you need. And then there now, and then you can do also sudo, sudo apt upgrade. There we go. And then you'll upgrade. And then there's some things you can download. Like I just showed you how to install Steam. I just made this and so what you can do is you can um, download like Steam apps like you can do uh, you can do sudo you can do sudo apt install ken kenden Live, wait, is that what it's called? Yeah, wait, nope. And then live, Ken. Wait, wait, wait. Yeah, yes, Ken did live. Ken did live. And then, and then it will go ahead and download, but since I already have it down here, and it's at the newest version, so it'll, it'll work. So basically, what Kenden Live is, is a video editor. You can open it, and it will load for a couple seconds. It's basically like, if you're a YouTuber like me, it is a video editor, and then it works best in full screen. And I'm not going to do anything right now because I'm um, videoing. you got all your buttons. you got everything for your like it's the best video editing you can have there's um timeline clips projects um audio sound effects all that good stuff so tell me what you think in the comments down below what you think about this and there are some all these other apps like down here um I, uh, I, this is LibreOffice, and this is all stuff for Steam, which I downloaded. Like, you can go to your terminal, you can do sudo apt install, um, let's see, LibreOffice. Yep, and then since I already have it, it's just updated me, updated mine. And yeah, there's make many more things you can do with Linux. And yeah, I hope this video helped you. I'll see you all in the next video. Maybe I'll post some more cool things you can do with Linux in my next video. Yeah, see you all in the next video. Goodbye.